Hey guys, Tofu here, and welcome to another random Wednesday game. Uh, they don't know if this is falling out on a Wednesday, so I'm just gonna call it a random game. I wanted to showcase it easier instead of making it on a Wednesday, because I'm not very consistent with that. I figure it's easier to do it whenever I get the chance to, and post it whenever I get the chance to. Um, but anyway, I wanted to showcase Wizard of Legend. I've been playing it a lot lately, and I think it's fantastic. So I wanted to, you know, play it for you guys. I've been playing a bunch on my own, and I've kind of figured out some of the mechanics. But other than that, it's kind of still a mystery. Like, I can sort of do good, but most of the time I just suck. I haven't checked out what all the items do yet, or how many good spell combinations exist. So right now I'm kind of like in like a cheesy spell casting mode. But anyway, um, I will showcase the beginning of the game. And then dive into some of what it basically is, which is a dungeon crawler roguelike. So, let's get started. Here we are, guys. Welcome to, I guess, the tutorial area of this place. Uh, hey, Alex, what do you want to talk about? I love to come by, relax, and feed the birds. I'm glad you do, buddy. <laughs> if you're looking for the Museum of Lenova, it's just up ahead. Thanks. <laughs> I'll be sure to go check it out. But, look at these birds. Fuck these birds. But the- <laughs> Fuck you, Mr. Dash Around the Clock. But I love, um, the pixel art in this. It's freaking awesome. It's really adorable. What are you guys? Hey, Spike. Uh, did you know that true wizards never ever take off their hoods? Never ever? Ever ever ever? <laughs> Maya. <laughs> never. Alright, well that was cute. Um, uh, hey, but, but, okay, I guess you're not saying, fuck you, buddy, you're just gonna dash around me? Fuck you. Okay, um, hey, Matt, I'm supposed to meet my friend here for the Chaos Trials exhibit, but she's running a bit late. Okay, well, that's cool, dude. And information lady, what do you got? Welcome to the Museum of Lenova. Here's a complimentary airburst dash arcana for your convenience. Oh, thank God. At least this game knows that all I need in life is to dash around the fucking room because it's too long. <laughs> hey, Jacob. But we love coming to the museum. All the exhibits are so fun and interactive. He's always getting so excited about this place. All right. Well, fuck you. At least he cares, okay? He cares. Anyway, we get to dash around and learn about stuff. So this is an lightning element arcana. They're pr it's pretty good. I don't know what counters. I don't know if it tells you counters and stuff. But this is an earth element arcana. Uh, this is a air element arcana. And fire, you know, just in case you didn't know. And this is water slash ice, depending on the variant you want to use. Maybe this is it. Ice and lightning do not do well against each other. But maybe fire does. No, it has to be the connection. I guess fire, water, and lightning all hurt each other in some ways. While earth, wind, and fire hurt each other in other ways. But the info table says, On display are some of the arcana that wizards use in the Chaos Trials. These arcana were created by virtuosos who imbued their masterpieces with elements refined from chaos. By channeling their magic energy or magical energies through these arcana, wizards would summon the powerful elements depicted on these works. Hmm, that's cool. Uh, what do you want to say, Mary? It's great that Arcana are protected by the magic they're created with. That means I could take all the flash photos I want. Okay, that's cool. How about you two? Sam, it's always surprising just to see how many different Arcana they had back in the day. <laughs> it makes sense as each Arcana crafting virtuoso had a different designs and goals in mind. Hmm, okay. This is every Arcana was handcrafted by a skilled virtuoso like the one shown here. Every Arcana, okay, it's the same thing. And wizards of the time typically favored six arcana hand fashioned to their style. Okay, so that explains the limit on the bottom. So every wizard uses six. Hey, what are you doing? That's cool. I wish I had fire like that. Jeez. Hey, Car hey, Kara. Yes, this is exactly what I got into costume for. Okay, and you? That dragon arc arcana would be awesome at the fireworks show. Okay. And what are you going to tell me? Hey there, here are a couple of Arcana for you to try out. While the replicas don't have any real effects, you could use them in the museum's interactive exhibits. Try giving those training dummies a good one, too. Alright, so we'll try this out. So we got Wind Slash, 
or Wind Scar. Uh, what's it? Oh god, what's the Inuyasha joke? Um, Wind Scar Demon Sword. Yeah, yeah. All right, and then that's fucking awesome. I like the. Okay, so you can can you sort of have some freedom with how you can control stuff. It's really around the six axes. Oh, is it the one, two, three? What, the eight axes? Yeah, the eight axes, I guess. Because you can spin it around on a thumbstick. And yes, I'm going to use a controller for this one because I don't trust myself with a mouse and keyboard, um, especially. This is, okay, Museum Chairman Donaby Kim. And you are Museum Benefactor Jason Choi. And you guys are Museum Benefactors Jacob Birch, Melissa Hill, and Indy. I guess these are people who funded the game? The Museum of Lenovo would like to thank our most generous sponsors. Okay. And what are you guys gonna say? Betty. He's so excited to try all the Arcana. Okay. That's pretty cool. It's a... F what spell is that? It looks like a cool fire spell. Uh, I've read all the books written about Signature Arcana. They all seem to have enhancements that are enhancements that alter their spells in some way to make them more effective. Hmm. This is Signature Arcana, Whirlwind Tornado. This is Flame Breath, which I guess is what that is. And then Arc Ball Lightning. Okay. Kimberly, these flames feel surprisingly nice and toasty. I'm glad I didn't bring a sweater. Too hot. Must leave now. Maybe because your beard's on fire, bro. Um, rare and specialized versions of Signature Arcana. Oh, so Signature Arcana were just specialized versions of Standard Arcana that absorbed nearby magical energy. When fully charged, these Arcana released devastatingly powerful versions of the spell they contained. Alright, that's pretty dope, I guess. Uh, shooting giant balls of fire from your hands is awesome. I know, right? Let's use a few slashes to get into the groove and then blast them away. Okay, so that's the same thing. And these are two versions of each other, so one's the normal and one's the signature. Yeah, it's more elaborate. It's a drastic change in the card type. Okay, what are you going to tell me? Oh, so I got a full Arcana thing. Okay. Oh, so basically I just get a, a stronger Kamehameha. That's cool. Okay, cool, cool. And this is the Fire Flame Empress Zeal. Okay. Earth Lord Atlas and Frost Queen Freya. Hmm. Chaos or an annual invitational event administered by the Lenova Council of Magic. These, p these powerful wizards were masters of their chosen elements and fashioned the trials for our contestants to undertake. Okay, cool. Um, ooh. These types of fight monsters? The, my uh, the mighty Chaos Knight readies for battle. This is the fearsome Chaos Mage. Okay. And this is a stealthy Chaos Rogue shifts into the shadows. Okay, cool. I mean, I'm not going to talk to everybody because it seems unlikely or not very helpful. Chaos gems were rare crystals that were often used as currency for various artificers of the time. And that's standard metallic coins to trade for goods and services. And I think these are chaos arts? Yeah, these are chaos arcana. That's cool. So I guess chaos spear. I don't know what the fuck a yo-yo is going to do. And that looks like chaos orbs. That's dope. And this is what... Oh, the Chaos Trials Interactive Course. Okay. So this is basically like what it's like to take a real trial. Okay. Thanks, information lady. So let's try this out. Okay. I got a Freezing Spirit of Naya. Okay, what can we do? What's going on? Okay. Oh, shit. So the Naya is going to freeze people for me. So that's what that will do. No, buddy. Not getting close to me. Cool. Ooh, Frost Fan. Cool. Uh, <laughs> fucked up already. Got you. Ah. I feel like this is very slow. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's the attack. Maybe it's just the wind slash feels very slow. I don't know. I feel like from all my times playing with different spells, these all seem very slow. All these attacks. Um, what the hell are you? You're a giant fucking slime. Got him. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> 
There we go. Got them all lined up. Sweet. Let's get some free food real quick. Thank you. All right. Let's go over here. Um, what is this? Wizards who enter the Chaos Trials were usually garbed in standard wizarding cloak as shown here. They were all allowed to enter the Trials with one of each of the four classes of Arcana, as well as a relic of their choosing. I wonder why it's only one. And then display were some of the relics that were used. Each has unique relics with powerful attributes that the wizards used to great effect in the Trials. Okay. And then here's robes, I guess. Yeah, the wizarding cloaks were used in the Chaos Trials were optimized for quick movement and Arcana usage. Many of these cloaks were enchanted by skilled tailors and have a variety of potent effects. Okay, that's pretty freaking cool. What's this? Wizards entering the Chaos Trials often had grimoires full of arcana in their possession. However, only one arcana of each class could be used in the Trials, and they were required to fashion a limited hand that suited their strengths. Cool. And what's going on over here? Uh... The Insignia of Legend was a mark of distinction, granted only to those wizards who successfully overcame the Chaos Trials. Other than its ceremonial use, not much else is known about the relic other than that it was created, crafted directly from Chaos Energy. Uh, oh shit. What is this? So this is some straight spirited away nonsense. Okay. Uh, pardon me, are you alright? That looked like quite a tumble there. Um, I'm okay. Woo, glad to see you're okay. Welcome to your new home away from home. As a wizard invited to participate in the Chaos Trials, your accommodations and services are provided by the Magical Con or the Magic Council. Also included is a one-time stipend of 100 Chaos Gems. You have to excuse the mess. We weren't expecting any guests so soon. But not to worry, we'll have everything sorted out shortly. In the meantime, let's do a round of introductions. Uh... A pleasure to meet you. I'm Tomy. I'll be cataloging all the arcana you come across. Uh, I can peruse the gallery now. So, I can actually explain the magic I'm using. So, right now I'm using Wind Spinner. Seems very fun for me right now. I'm using Ice Dash, because Air Burst isn't as good. Uh, homing Flares, which you'll see what they do in a bit. And Shock Nova, because I like doing dumb shit like that. And there's not really any good spells besides it right now. So, I'm just using that. This is Mimi. Hey, I'm Mimi, and I'll be snacking on all the relics you find. But don't worry, they'll be safe and ready whenever you need them. Good to know. Um, right now, I have the Relics Reward card. Because typically in this game, or the, what I've been realizing is since I make money, you make gold as you fight, that I need cheaper relics to buy to keep me going versus cheaper spells because I like the spells I currently have, and I don't need to buy really shit spells all the time. But, um, and then you are Ward. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Ward, and all of your enchanted attire will be in my charge. Now let's see what fashionable outfits I have ready for you. Alright, and I am using Shift, because the other outfits I have I just didn't like. The red one is the standard one, which has no benefit. Patience is blue, which is the other outfit you get if you do co-op or whatever. I think you start with either one. But um, Vigor just increases max health and increases defense, which I don't seem to need. Um... I like to evade and crit chance. Uh, there's also tempo, which decreases cooldowns and increases run speed, which seems cool. But I guess I just like the crit chance. But then there's this guy, Awe, who has the increased critical chance and crit damage, which seems pretty cool. But I just like to evade if I can. I don't know. And I also like Raven, so purple is the way to go. So now you know my favorite color and my getup or my set my setup for this uh, particular game. All right, so let's bounce in. I, don't, I can't buy anything, but this is the basic area when you start out. You have to come over here. This is where you buy relics of usage, and you can talk to Mimi again to change them out. Over here is the spells you can buy, which they change every time you come out, either from a trial run or from your home. They will vary out. You can practice your skills over here. As you can see, that was the Nova Blast. This is Homing Flares, and that's my Wind Spinner. So those are my attacks. You can buy costumes up here with this nice dude over here. There's, there's varying ones every time. They'll, these won't change, so what happens is unless you buy a costume, it won't get a new one. So you'd have to buy every single one. Oh, you're you're attacking me? Oh, last minute entrance. The council has informed us of your arrival. You are free to proceed. Oh, so when I did that, okay, cool, I guess. Um, but anyway, let's get past this and jump on into our first run. Because this is kind of the real meat and potatoes of this game is what we're about to do. 
uh, as you can see, there's three tiers and then a fourth tier, which I have never even seen because I'm not that good at this game. But I like the majority of this. And I also like breaking shit because you never know if there's coins there. Um, but basically, kind of just the game is go in, roguelike dungeon, so it'll change the size variably. And I do that, and I avoid all the monsters. Basically, you try to stay alive as long as you can, clear the bosses, or clear the levels to get to the next one, and then, um, uh, I guess you kind of kill bosses, clear the next level, kill the trial bosses, which are the three, and then I guess when you get to the end, you get the chaos fights, and if you win that, I guess you get granted chaos powers. I'm not sure how this game ends. Oh. Oh, it's you again. What do you do? Can you say what you do? Okay, so you're Taffy. So a combo breaker. So I have to out combo you. Okay, I guess I can try this. So I'll have to come back for this because I think I need another spell shot just to get through them. And what I mean by that is that I need to get. If I can get acquire another spell, I'll be able to do the full damage I need to do to him because it's just he's so close to dying. Come over here, Stone Golem. You suck. You suck, bro. You suck, bro. There you go. Alright, cool. So as you fight, you get awarded coins as well as gems. Gems are your big currency like you saw outside, so that's how you buy spells and costumes and stuff. But um, gold are the, the, the normal coins you don't really use unless you're in here. It's basically the gist of it. And you can kill guys with uh, environmental hazards, which is also great. So it allows me to do stuff that, you know, otherwise wouldn't be as easy. Okay, so this is a boss room. It's great I got to see all this so quickly. Uh, I'm going to spawn back. You can use these teleporters to go to all the rooms you've seen already. So it also works out to find it, because then every time you go to a specialist room, you can always get back to it. Oh god, oh god, okay. That's an archer right there, with the fire arrows. Alright, good. Got him, woo! Good. Alright, that was, that was dangerous. Uh, but we're doing good so far, I guess. I mean, not the best I could do, but we're doing alright. Not too bad. But you can also stun people. And I guess that's why the star thing matters so much. But the the Nova's very good because it does like an auto stun everywhere. While well, I don't have to do too much effort while doing it. And it's super attack is that. So <laughs> what could go wrong when that's your super? So everything's pretty decent. Oh fuck, okay, okay. Gotcha, you archer. Ha! Got him. Cool. So I outsmarted them this time. That was good. Um, I haven't found the spellcaster yet, but I have almost checked out all of this place, so I guess he's not on this floor? That's odd. I don't think I've ever had a situation where I've never seen him. Oh, no, he's over there. Okay. So, yeah, I can I can sprint towards him. So, uh, I don't know. I'm trying to think what's the best part so far about this game. I think it's just the challenges you face most of the time. I really do enjoy them. But Taffy's still fucking there, that little scrub. Gotta kill him. Alright, what spells are here? Okay, so we can get uh, a Thunder Drop, which I don't want, because I think it replaces... It. Well, no, because if we buy it in here, it won't replace the spell, but... Uh, Shattering Strike... Earth... Grasping Earth actually might be worth to keep. Tearing Whirlwind... Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna... Wait, what does the, the Merchant have? So there's some benefits, like if he had... No, he doesn't have what I want. So I'm going to go get that one then. I'll have enough money for other stuff too. Or I'll waste a lot on this, actually. Yep, Grasping Earth took a lot. But I wanted it so I could... I don't know what that does. Uh, I'm assuming that it will do what I want to do, which is... Uh, let's see what it does, actually. Hey, Taffy. All right, so we got to wait. Restart. Let's do this. <laughs> got him! Fuck! That took so fucking long. All right. I did it. <laughs> I fucking did it. Cool. And we got this. Which is something. 
I don't know what that does, but cool. So we scooped up some nice stuff, and we have enough for a health bottle, so I'm gonna... Hmm. 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 Grease boots, I think, increases dodge evasion chance. Um, do I want that potion? Do I really want that potion? Yes, I do. <laughs> That's a lie. I'll just take the potion. We'll beat the boss and see what we get. Let's go. All right, so this is our first boss. The Strafe Archer. Alright, let's get a fuck you, dude. Yes! Let's go. Alright, so that's basically the gist. We beat the crap out of people and uh, continue forward. Fuck, I wanted those combo gloves. Oh, no. Oh, that sets me back so far. We beat Taffy, so there's nothing we can sell. We just kind of... I guess we go. Alright. <laughs> so we got a couple gems. We cleared most of the map. It only took us nine minutes because fucking Taffy. But let's proceed. Let's see where we go from here. This is level two. Okay. So it loads up every time. I think they kind of look the same for the most part. Sometimes they change them. I could also pay gems over to randomize it. So if let's say you get bored of uh, the certain structure, you think it's too good, too easy, you can randomize it and change it up for yourself and make it more fun. More interesting, of course. I shouldn't have bought that potion with all this fucking health just lying around. But, oh well. It happens. I, I, I usually buy it just in case. Because what if I didn't get it, you know? Alright, so that, that fist is very, like, slow on the recovery, so it's not worth it in that regard. Tidal Blast! That looks pretty freaking cool. There's Water Basic, Air Dash, and Enhanced Exploding Fireball. I don't know if I like that lightning strike, so it kind of sucks to have it, and I'm stuck with it. Oh, so we have you here. Uh, this guy is the, the tailor. You pay money to get your costume fixed, but at the same time, or enhance it, but at the same time enhancing it hurts you a bit, so it's not the rest. I mean, actually, if I had 100 gold, I would buy it just because I'm, like, at the best health I could be at right now. Yeah, you guys are going. Ooh. Going down, Archer. Going down. Cool. Yeah, I'm actually going to buy that costume upgrade. It seems worth it. God damn you, spear fucker. Okay, good. Good. Actually, I'm going to get this health from here. Good. And I'm going to go run back to that costume, dude, because I want that. Because if I can enhance this, I think it increases my crit chance, and I only take a little bit of health damage, I think. We'll see. Uh, just in time. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Oh, uh, cause some discomfort. Oh, okay. It's just a, you know, 125 health loss. But cool. Now I have an enhanced coat. I don't know what that does. I, I don't know how to check it either. But now I'm enhanced. So maybe I have enhanced crit damage and enhanced invasion. I have no idea. But let's see where it takes us on this run. Per chance. Um, let's go up here. Ow. Jeez, I thought I had my spell, and I guess I didn't. Alright, cool. Because I usually like to burst with my Nova. And then, uh... Yeah, I gotta get rid of this Earth Grab. It seems like it's too slow and doesn't respond the way I want it to. But it happens, you know. I, I wanted to see what a spell would work to help me get through that part, and I chose wrong. But that's basically kind of how this goes a lot of the times. So you pick stuff up and you have to learn, and then you find out the right min-max combination. Fuck you, jumping enemies. Fuck, 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 fuck. Still doing bad. You know what? I think Earth needs you to actually wait. I think that's the issue. Unlike the other spells that don't really care, like, lightning can start on a dime. The Earth Grab might need me to stop and then use it. That might be my issue. That might be my issue all along, actually. All right, this is another room. All right, got. Oh my god! Got you. Oop. 
fuck you archers, man. Oh my god. Okay. Got through them. Whew. All right. Dodge that one. That was nice. <laughs> So far, so good. I haven't done too poorly on this run other than really dumb mistakes that could easily be cha fixed, I mean, for the most part. But we've checked out 100% of this map, so now we can get stuff we need. So we have 200 coins. We'll obviously get more coins once we beat the boss. But first things first is we're going to get that health potion because we need it, like, so desperately. Okay. And let's go fight the boss because that's all we can really do right now. Let's go, buddy. Oh god, I didn't realize his fires were right there. Oh god! Okay, I'm getting fucked up. Oh god! I'm focusing way too much on my fireball, or the, the, the earth one, and it's just not doing what I want to do. Grab them. Yeah. Not my best spell choice. Okay, got you, buddy. But when they use the light, or they glow yellow, they do their special. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, here goes the first round. All right, so this is round two. After my horrible debacle there, and getting destroyed utterly by the, the likes of uh, fucking random scrubs in the middle of a dungeon. Or I guess I took too many fireballs to the face. That's probably it. But anyways, now we're in the ice version, so so it's like the, the pathway changes too, so while you could say, um, so I guess there's a multiple variations of what rogue is, what changes, what's different. So you can get three different variations, um, the first one being fire, like we saw, which has its maps and, and monsters or uh, chaos knights devoted to it. And Freya Zone, which is the ice world, and then Gaia, or that knight dude, the, the earth dude, and his world, which is full of poison knights and stuff. Ow! Get out of there. I, oh, gotcha. Get in there. Good. Okay. So we cleared all that. But yeah, there's variations in that, as well as the maps and the characters you face, so that's a lot of things. I don't think the archers change much. I think they have special skills per level. Fuck, you waited that extra second, you son of a bitch. But you're all alone now, you little archer. I need fire hits, probably, for him, though. Now that we're in a fi an ice zone, wind isn't going to cut it. And we don't have any water, so that's probably why we got destroyed so quickly. Oh, let's make a deal with the devil. Great. So, these are other stuff. Um... So of the reds, or I guess I'll call them the red portals, but there's variations. Like there's that, that pinata we beat the crap out of. There's that dude who gives you a cursed item, and that item you just exchange. Um, so it's like a good thing with a bad consequence, I suppose. Uh, no, it isn't. It's a bad consequence. So if you got special boots, they would give you higher evasion. Oh, God. Okay. That was just way too many fucking things at once. Good. Okay. Whew. Fuck you, Frost Knights. Let's go. All right, cool. That worked out. But um, there's variations. So like, uh, good boots could give you high evasion, but low uh, or double damage. I haven't checked out what other ones do, so it's kind of like a hit or miss for me. I don't know much about it. I should learn about it. Oh well, I guess let's we'll run through the boss and we'll keep going. I don't think I need health. I think I'm okay. I think I could take him on. Um, let's do it. Let's go, buddy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. God damn you, Lancer. Got you, you bitch. Got him! Yeah! Let's go! <laughs> Alright, cool. So we got a bunch of health back, and we got the Midas! Cool, Glove of Midas is pretty clutch, so we'll get more gold while we're in here. So that's always good. I don't think I need any of this. Augur of Poetry, uh, Phoenix Talon... No, no, this is okay. Let's just go. Uh, I kind of want to take one of these. <laughs> 
<laughs> what does that do? Increased damage, but no, signature can no longer be charged. Oh, fuck. <gasps> what is that? Oh, I get it now. It means I can't auto, like, super kill. That's fine. I'll take that. Um... Oh no, I forgot! Fuck! Fuck! Okay. Alright, here's the next stage. Let's go. So, I fucked up and didn't- Ooh! Okay. So, I fucked up and didn't buy the upgrade for the wind spin, but I did also take uh, a demonic possession just to see what it- or a demonic relic just to see what it would do. And it's pretty cool, but I feel like it's gonna fuck me in the long run because I'm gonna need something else that I can't do anymore. So I'll show you right now. I took uh, the Sharpened Stylus, which allows more damage, but I cannot charge my signature. So, do not expect to see any more uh, super electric attacks <laughs> ever again because I kind of just threw that away. Uh, broke that. We're doing good on the, the money side of things. We're not doing too poorly. So I guess we have a lot of money for this area. Hopefully we can buy some good stuff. Maybe. Come here, Frost Knight. Alright. Yeah, so when it's 1v1, I just run through them, but jeez. Why it's some crazy people. Get rid of her. God damn it. Get rid of her. Fuck. Got you. Good, they're all gone. Whew. Those freaking little bodies are insane to deal with. Alright, got through you guys. Oh. Hey, buddy. Cool. Got rid of him without having to... Ow! Fucking fight him head on. Cool. Got you. Fuck! That was not good. Alright, we're just gonna come down here then. Alright, cool. So we blew through them way faster than the other way. That's kind of dumb. I guess because you can keep hitting them while you do it. Which is slightly easier to do than just uh, hitting them from afar. Alright. Uh, well, I guess it's the combination. The magic plus the hitting at max da or higher damage, I guess. Okay. I could understand that then. Oh, uh, man. Oh, God. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. I think I'm hitting his fire out of the sky. But I don't think I have an item that does that. Wow, that was fucking quick. So if I time it right and hit him with the fire first, those fucking guys don't have this. Ow! Oh, I can hit projectiles out of the sky, I guess. Hmm. Just keep coming towards me, buddies. That's exactly what you're doing. Cool. Oh, fuck! How'd you get me? Fucking. Fucking dick. Alright, cool. Got through that. Got some health. Okay, I guess this is the boss room. We've cleared everything, but we found nothing else. Um, That's unique, I guess. Can't break that. That's good to know. Alright. We should be able to find some rooms. We have a lot of money as well. We've also killed all the enemies somehow, so there's that positive. All right, so here's the island item god here. Uh, we got to get a frozen spirit, permafrost, analytical molecule, noxious dapper cap, which I don't think we want any of this. If it's freezing, I don't think it matters right now. We're about to fight. Oh, great. It's another combo boss, so I got to save you for later, fucking Taffy. This will be round two with your bitch ass. Uh, all right, let's go over here. Let's go over here. But I don't know. I guess it's just the way this game feels. It feels so good. It feels very, um, the controls feel very tight. Compared to what I've, I was expecting. I, like, I was expecting some, like, um, some Magicka-esque, like, lollygagging going on. But this game kind of blew me away with how it feels. Everything feels great. I love all the animations. I don't need any of these things. Maybe Firewall actually sounds pretty fucking dope. I'm gonna take that. Alright, so let's go to fucking Taffy's room and kick his ass real quick. 
cool. So firewall, pretty clutch, because you just pin him against it. And we got another one, which is... Oh, wait, what? What? What does that do? Uh, increase number of strikes. Ride a bolt of lightning to shock foes in an area. Increase number of strikes. That doesn't increase the number of strikes. Maybe it's like, if there's, if I bolt into people, it hurts them. And it keeps going around. We'll try that out. I'm gonna take one of you things with me. Uh, I need the potion, that's for sure. And I'll come back for the freezing spirit, I think. I want that more than the frost cube. But, cool. On to the next boss. Let's go. Oh, shit! That's fucking dope! That is fucking dope. Holy shit. I have never liked an attack so much as that. That is just beautiful. And we got the Dark Katana. Sick. Now we get even more crit damage. Oh, man. That's fucking sick. All right. So I don't think we need any more spells. I think we're good. The only thing I'd probably change out is... Um, Analytical molecule. Or monocle. Mon <laughs> molecule. Uh, I don't know what that does. So I want to get it. Let's see what it does. What do you do? Increase crit chance. Perfect. That's exactly what I need more than anything else. Increase my freaking... Increase Raven's super crit chance. And uh, let's keep going. So we completed the map again. And now we're moving on to Freya. So all we gotta do is kick her ass. Um, this is a re This is actually a, a run it back for me. Because... On uh, my run before I started recording, I got to her and fucking got wrecked by her. So we're gonna do this again. But it's too late to get cold feet. Because I'm about to freeze you in your tracks. Oh yeah? Let's go, Freya. Let's fucking go. Alright, what do you got first? Alright. Oh fuck, alright. I'm very fucking up. Come on. All right, so she's got water projectile. Ooh. Ah, fuck. I got fucking caught. Fuck me. Got her. Woo! I didn't expect that to work out. I think I actually just took a gamble there, but that was good. Not bad. You certainly know how to stay cool. Ta-ta for now and stay frosty. I will, Freya. I fucking will. Yes! We got her back. Fuck yeah. And we unlocked a new spell. Uh, this is Blazing Lariat. Uh, what does that do? I would love to change that with this, actually. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> yo, that is... Holy shit. Yes. I... Oh, my God. I'm going to use that shit forever. Oh, but as... Oh, the other side effect of getting farther is that the enemies do more crazier attacks. And they are more uh, vicious. Uh, they're ready to kill me. So I'm going to have to be more on my toes now than before. So I'll probably be buying a lot of uh, medical, medical supplies as time goes on. But as long as I can keep up and keep... Or I guess keep the, the stronger wizards at bay, the little lighter ones shouldn't do too much damage to me. But it's alright. I'm still testing stuff and trying to figure out what perfect min-max magic works for my playstyle. Because I don't think I'm going to change coats unless there's like a better uh, robe than crit chance and evasion. I just like evasion way too much. And I could always make my crits better. That's all. But so far, so good. We are doing okay. Uh, we're taking hits that we shouldn't be taking, but it's fine. I'll be alright. Oh, man. This game. Fuck. got really intense now. I also feel really good beating Freya like I did. And that attack is also very fucking good. 
If you can land that, that is freaking dirty. Ah, fuck. Alright. Here we go. Oh, man. Okay, good. Woohoo! Dodged the arrow and got through the spear, man. That was a little unlucky. Okay, so we'll save money for now. Combo gloves and health are what I really want from there. Um, combo gloves specifically because it adds another attack to your, it adds another attack to your basic hits, so my whirlwind will get an extra benefit to it. And I think you get an extra attack, which only helps, especially if you're trying to kill people like Taffy or a boss. That extra hit will help. So this wave front dash is on is uh, enhanced, so that's a super spell. Uh, Dragon Dive, that seems cool too. It might be a, a type of, um, that's okay, man. Uh, it might be a type like, uh, the, the RB, the Lightning Strike I have right now that allows me to get close. Oh, oh, there's another person. If we leave her in Arcana, we could get stuff for it. So I'm debating on leaving behind, uh, oh, so I have to swap it in. Or maybe I have to do it on my own? No, it doesn't... Let's do that. Can I... Let me talk to you. I'm studying for it. Yeah. Fuck! I got rid of the wrong one! Shit. Alright, I guess I get this for now. What does this do? Receive a discount whenever you purchase potions from a merchant. Oh! That actually is pretty clutch. Thank you. I, I mean, I wish I didn't give up the Lariat. Because Flame Wave just seems obviously not... I mean, actually... No, that's not that bad. That's not that bad, actually. Thinking about it now, that's a pretty good spell to have. But now that we get that added bonus from buying um, buying health, that health card seems pretty clutch. If I could earn that as an item outside of here, that would make everything so much... I mean, I guess not really, but I would prefer it. Okay, so here's the enhanced monster, the black mobs. They basically just charge you faster, I think. It's like zombies, virtually, at that point. Okay. Oh, I guess... <laughs> that is arguably better. <laughs> I mean, I should have been ready for him, but, I mean, besides that, that was beautiful. Just let him run to the wall. He'll die. Unless they can jump over it, they're pretty much just burning themselves. I don't know if you guys can tell, but <laughs> I'm basically, like, fangirling over this game. I fucking love playing it. Even though I'm not doing the best. Even though it might not be the best gameplay of this game, and you could probably get better at it. I freaking love it. Can I put another firewall? Yes, I can. Fuck you, dudes. That is so fucking good. Use the elements to their advantage. Just fire. Oh, God. Those guys got me good. Okay. Come here, buddy. Gotcha, bro. It's just when they're together, it makes it harder, I think. I can handle them, most of them, solo. Because, I mean, they can't do damage once I put stuff up, so. And the, the rogue, I have to just dodge his fire dash. That's his. That's how he got me before, I think. They both fire dash, and they got a lot of damage through. Cool. Got through that. Cool. So far, so good. Oh, fuck. There's another rogue. Good! Holy shit, I didn't expect that to go so well. <laughs> Whew, that was good. That was good. Good. That was, those are the plays. Alright, so let's run. Actually, I want to run the other way. I want to check out this side of the map. Oh, man. Alright, let's go over here. What's in here? Oh, it's just the blobs. Got him. Cool. Doing freaking great. All right. Whew. I'm doing good at this run. I'm actually feeling feeling it. I'm feeling great. Um, I guess taking that deal with the devil panned out this time. Sometimes it doesn't. Ooh, okay. Just putting that firewall up. Now it's going to kill you separately because you're an asshole. Just come to that fire, buddy. Thank you. Fuck you. 
cool. Got rid of you. Ah, fuck. All right, there we go. Got this. Cool. Got them all. That was really lucky. Oh, no. Oh, that's really lucky. I got them both on the same side. Oh, holy shit. Woo! <laughs> I guess that's why the lightning's so powerful and enhanced. Because if I hit one dude, it'll allow me to hit them both at the same strike. That's probably it. Yeah, oh, that's it. Yeah, that's it. That is freaking awesome. All right, got those blobs out of the way. I'm very low on health, so I need to find uh, this medical dude. Otherwise, I'm not going to last too long. Oh, thank God. All right, there we are. Cool, got some health back because I needed that. Mirror shield would be good right now. Maybe some Tesla coil in this. Though, I think that just hurts people more. Um, I think it just gives like a shock every so often. So let's get that with me and I guess we'll just carry it for now. Let's see what's in store for us up ahead. Uh, that's used already, so we gotta go straight up north. Okay, let's make a right here, because there's obviously a room here. Alright, so the, the makeshift clerk's here. Uh, let me check out the rest of that room, I guess. There's no more enemies, so that's another good sign. So everything left is just the stores, I guess? Somehow I went through this entire map and never found a store until now. Uh, Ion Spike, Trap Dash, and Curl it. Creeping Tentacles would be good, but I like the Firewall right now. It might be worth getting that just because, um, well, I can't get it anyway. I don't think I'll make enough money off the boss, so that goes that idea. But it'd be worth it if I could solely for um, the ability that it hurt. Oh, God, there's more of you still. There's no enemies there. Fuck. Oh god, that's such a bad spell against you. Oh god, that was such a bad spell against you of all people. That was so bad. Oh no. <laughs> I'm super low on health now. Oh god, okay. I guess I'm gonna have to clutch up on this boss then and hopefully not die. Um... Is there anything else I can do? I could pay for an enhancement, but that won't help. I don't have enough money for that enhancement anyway. Uh, is there anything I can buy from here? Nope. All right, I guess this is it. It's do or die moment here, guys. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. All right. Oh, it's a burst mage, that's great. I just gotta kill everybody else. Kill them and everything gets easier. All right, one burst mage down. All right, whew. So he has like a unique special now. All right, come on, buddy. All right, let's go, buddy. I feel like your, your special is so lackluster right now, buddy. There it is. And let's just kill you. Woohoo! Do or die. Clutched up. <laughs> now I have to somehow win against a boss like this. <laughs> That's it. That's what I need in life is to somehow win against the boss. Um, let's just get mirror shield, I guess. This will reflect, I think, I think something once. Uh, so if someone's a shield that reflects one projectile, shield breaks after reflect and respawns in a timer. Okay, so that was actually pretty worth it, especially to go up against a fire boss that I might not get enough hits on. But I do get one more health. So, alright, so that was it. That's all I get. <laughs> I'm at 182. So we gotta somehow beat Flame Empress Zeal. Are you warmed up yet? Because I'm bringing the heat. Alright, fuck it. Let's do this. Let's go, Zeal. I'm fucking ready for this shit. I'm not really ready for this shit. Okay. Whew. She put me on fire somehow.
All right, let's go. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Fuck. Fuck! Oh my god. Okay, 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 we're doing it, we're doing it! We're doing it! We've got one more in her, right? Yep. <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> you fuck! Ah! <laughs> fuck! That was so close. If I waited, if I just kept dodging, I think I would have been okay. Anyway, guys, um... Fuck, that was a good run. But I think this is where I'll call it here. Because I've been recording for a while and I figured I have enough of a good quality playing to showcase this game properly. Um, I fucking love this game. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. If you want to see me do some more random runs in the future or like more episodes of this game, I don't mind doing it. It's an easy sit down game. But I'll probably try to shorten it down to like of what this is, which it should be like a 30 minute video of just like the best clips between it. Cause it seems so, um, it doesn't seem like, I mean, I, I feel like this game might work better to, to stream in some cases. I don't think I want any of these. I guess I'll just take a rule. Um, but I keep buying these cause I want them, but I think it's easier and just do it that way. If you guys want to see me stream it, I'd be all for it. If you want to see me do more videos, that's fine too. Cause this game's fun and I enjoy it and it's not going to stop any other game I'm going to record and do, but I just figured, you know, I'll throw this in here. If you guys want to see it sometimes, just let me know. But this is Wizard of Legend and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will look at what this costume does before I stop, but this is increased damage and increased armor. That's actually pretty sick. Uh, I would take that if it had the invasion, but you know, it's fine. These all kind of do their own cool things. So tempo, speed, and all that stuff, and they all do their own things. I think I said it at the beginning of the video, but there's four other costumes left I still have to get. But uh, that's for another day. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this, and this is Tofuru signing out.